All right, welcome ladies and gentlemen. I appreciate you stopping by and taking the time out of your busy schedule. My name is Larry James. My company is Speak With Larry. And one of the things that I'm doing starting uh, January the 1st is I'm adding a few things to my system. And I wanted to share a little bit about those things with you. But first, I wanted to talk to you about your system. That's right. What are you going to implement new? in 2020 that you've been wanting to implement but you are still kind of straddling the fence on right something that you know you can do but you keep talking yourself out of it what is that for you yes i am talking to you because if you're not doing anything then you're wasting time and time is our most valuable asset now i'm also a speaker i enjoy getting in front of uh, our audience talking about things that uh, are motivational, things that are, you know, uh, inspirational, things that will make you go from point A to point B. But everyone is not comfortable with that skill, and I'm aware of that because I was not comfortable with that at all in the beginning. As a matter of fact, I fought against it, but I enjoy sharing information so much that. I had to figure a way to make it to make myself okay with that and one of those ways that I implemented was I started studying different people watching their mannerisms and how they do things and then another was I just stepped out right and when I stepped out I received what I thought I was going to receive you know the the feeling that I thought was would come from that I got that and I liked it, I liked that, right? But more than that, it required me to continue to study other people. And I liked that even better because there are some really brilliant people in this world, really successful people. And some people are brilliant who aren't successful. But I'm a person who loves stories. I love to hear pe people's stories because we all have different journeys in this thing called life. and. If you're willing to listen to someone else's story, it will make you feel differently about your story. Because sometimes we feel like our life or our story is, you know, the hardest anyone could imagine. Or everyone has a better life than we had. Oh, no. No, 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 no. There are people, if they tell you their story, you would not complain about your story. And you could be one of those people. But even with that, regardless of what your life took, where your life took you, you can overcome that as long as you're still alive. You see people all the time who, uh, you know, have gone through terrible, uh, what I would consider insurmountable type of situations, but they overcome it, right? So it's a choice. It's a choice. Just like this thing called life, you have a choice to do things in life now. One of the things I like about a new year coming is that it gives you an opportunity to think about changing some of the things that you did or that you've done or that you're doing, right? And by changing things, then you get the rewards of the benefits that come with that change. But you have to stick with it. You can't do it for three days and think you're going to get the results that you deserve because that's not how it works. You have to create a habit regularly you have to do it regularly and once you do that it becomes second nature like one of the one of my habits is i go to the gym five days a week sometimes i make uh, a miss sometimes i make two misses but i get back to five days a week as quickly as possible i don't hold that against myself when i miss it but i do five days a week when i when everything goes normal right if i'm not and if i don't have to be here and it throws my schedule off or i don't have to be there or off if i'm just tired right because nobody's perfect but i have that habit instilled within me so nobody has to say well larry you had not been to the gym in three days you need to get to the gym oh i know i already know and then i i enjoy the results that i get from doing that now you you can make that same type of change but it doesn't have to just be with the gym it could be with reading or, you know, uh, learning different things. You're going to commit to learning something that you didn't know. 
Now, I don't like to make these videos too long because, you know, people's attention span. So I'm going to stop right there. But I wanted to get this out because I want you to do something this year. I want you to think that you can do it. I want you to know that you can do it. And the very thing that's essential for you to get the rewards is for you to start. Start.